honey pie. Come away in and see who's at home today. Granny Murray's house has two at home to play. Granny Murray's house is home too. Who's here today? Well, we've got Robbie and Molly. Right, you two, on your feet. Come on, up you get. Let's have some fun. <laughs> Come on, that's the way. Now, you know how to play snap? Uh -huh. That's the way. On we go, on we go. Well, we've got Molly and Robbie, but someone's missing from home today. <laughs> Not anymore. Who's coming home to Granny Murray? It's Jack with Rudy. Hello there. <laughs> Rudy, hello. Hi, Granny Murray. And Jack. Hi, Mia. Yeah. <laughs> Here you come, yeah. Angel. No, 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 you're not starting yet. <laughs> What's all the noise in here then? Oh, we're playing oh, snap. snap. So I can hear. I think it's getting a wee bit rowdy, isn't it? <laughs> all right, my darlings. Why don't we dress up Claude as a football referee? Brilliant, great idea. Right, that's the way. Now, Careful, no, Oh, come on, we'll hit the dressing room, Rudy. <laughs> Oh, I didn't know you enjoyed football, Granny Murray. Well, I'm not a fan of watching it. I'd much rather be on the pitch kicking the ball to a teammate. Believe it or not, I'm organising a football match at the park later this morning. Oh, cool. Chuck and Louis said they'd come along too. Jack will love that. There really is nothing like teamwork to help get things done. I agree. But... Sitting here chatting ain't gonna get the spud sold. I'd best make a move to get the stall set up. Whoa, Claude yeah. looks like a proper ref. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, Claude looks like a real winner. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'd best be off before. What have you got for me? <laughs> Is that off Claude? No, it's a football snap keepsake from Jack. So I can have a cuddle. Oh, <laughs> 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 Right, I'll see you later. Okay. <laughs> and remember, there's really nothing like teamwork to get things done. Thanks, Granny Murray. I'll see you later. Bye bye, Flower. We'll be thinking of you. Me too. Now, you keep a wee eye on Rudy and make sure he goes the right way to work. I'm on my way to work today I'm walking my shoes through the city views I'm stepping along and I'm swinging me arms And I'm singing my way through the city's charms I get in there, it's just so fine I so enjoy my walking time I always go the way I know but can you tell me the way I go? Hey! OK, which way? And do I go left now? Or do I go right? Which way is wrong now? And which way is right? Right! OK, that way, to the market. I'm on my way to work today. I'm going this way and that away. Hello, cobbles. Hello, train. Hello, Roadworks! Hello, Tram! Hello, Sweeper! Hello, Van! He's on his way to work today Looking this way and that away Hey! Do I go up now? Or do I go down? Which way's a smile now? And which way's a frown? Ah! What, this way? You told me the way to go Thank you, you showed me the way I know Now what? Oh, that's right, I need to get changed for work All dressed and ready to go Hey, it sounds like Dale's CD stall's in full swing already God. 
Hello, love. Hey, I hear you and Chuck are off to the park later to play football with Granny Murray and our Jack. That's the plan. Though, we better find a bit of time to get some practice in before the game. Oops, <laughs> I'm a bit rusty. You can see that again. <laughs> well, look, here's a bag of lovely juicy oranges to hand round after the game. I'm sure you'll work up quite a thirst running about after that ball all day. Yes, yeah, some more than others. <laughs> Bye, Rudy, love. See ya. Bye. Oh, that'll be my eight o'clock breakfast call. I wonder whether Jack's having his breakfast now. I love to skip and river see ping, go river see ping, go by the sea. I love to skip and river see ping, go river see ping, go that's for me. I would like some fruit. Would you like some fruit? Oh, that's great news. Now, what would you two like? Cereal. Cereal. Fresh fruits from Rudy. Delicious. Is that enough, darling? Yeah. OK. Cereal for you, sweet pea. And some cereal for you, big boy. That's us. Oh, I think I'll have some fruit too. Oh, your dad would be delighted if he could see you eating your fresh fruit. Lovely, isn't it? Yes. Come on then, guys. <laughs> Jack, by the way. Always oh, great, thanks. Good. See ya. Oh, well, that's the first pineapple I've sold all day. Sold hardly any lemons or oranges, though. Better try out a few market cries, see if we can draw the crowds. Come on, ladies and gentlemen, roll up and get your juicy, juicy, juicy oranges right here. Hi, Rudy. Oh, great, a customer. What can I do for you? Uh, a bunch of the usual, please. Oh, Dale, it's you. Yeah, sorry, I've got a sore throat today. Oh, sorry to hear that, but the usual, you say? There you go. That's two pound, please. Yeah, thank you. And I hope your throat gets better. Me too. I won't be able to do my market cries otherwise. Oops, there's a customer. I'll better go. Catch you later. Bye. Speaking of customers, I better get down to work myself if I want to shift any of this lot. And do be do be do. I make it look easy. What I do be do be do. And what I do is sell to you and you and you. All of the veggies for a stew But it's more than meets the eye What I do for you as I buy and buy While you still sleep those fruit and veg to eat And the flowers in the early hours So when wake up comes It's there for you the market stalls are there to view Oh, the market, the market What a wonderful place oh, The hub of the people The smiles on each face oh, The market, the market Come look around oh, The hustle, the bustle The bubbles of sound The colours all chaotic And spilling about the smell's all exotic, yeah, the market cries out Objects to excite you and draw you near The buying and the selling, cheap or dear The market, the market, I just love to be there The market is a wonderful place These are the plastic goods that you need today, take it away Today then, Rudy. Hi, Bobby. Um, the lemons, they're on special. You get six for just one pound. One more? One bag. Now, what was that again? Oh, if you like the lemons, you'll have to have some of my juicy oranges. They're on special too. What did you say? Smashing. I'll get you a bag of them too. Perfect for keeping them constant cold if they are oranges and lemons. Yeah, but I, I didn't want any lemons. Oranges? Back down, oh, baby. brilliant. Oh, oh dear, oh, I'm going to be late for the 11 o'clock bus, Rudy. I'm going to have to dash. Sorry. But what about Hi. your fruit? Oh, 11 o'clock and I've hardly sold anything. The market today is louder than the crowd at a big football match. 
No wonder Bobby couldn't hear me. I hope it's quieter in the park for Louis and Jack's football game. I love to skip in River Seat Thing, River Seat Thing, oh, that's for me. Let's play football! Time to get down to a little hard work of my own. Ladies and gentlemen, you don't need a rocket ship to taste food that's out of this world. It's here, it's fresh, and it's only gonna cost. Roll up, roll up, get your bargains here. Everything must go. Everything must go, so make your way. So make your way to Rudy's Fruit and Veg Store. Oh, it's no use. I've hardly sold anything this morning. I might as well just pack up early and go home. After all, it seems nobody can hear my market cries. Where did the time go? At seven o'clock, I went and dropped Jack off at Granny Murray's. Granny Murray told me all about the football match they were to play against Louie and Chuck later that morning. Granny Murray even had the children dress Claude up as a football referee to get them in the mood. At eight o'clock, I arrived at the market. Dale's CD music was very loud. At nine o'clock, Dale popped across from his CD stall to buy some fruit. He had an awfully sore throat. Then at 12 o'clock, Bobby passed to buy some lemons and oranges, or at least I think that's what she asked for. I couldn't really hear anything for all the noise on the market, and Dale's CD stall getting louder and louder. Now remember, there's really nothing like teamwork to get things done. There really is nothing like teamwork to get things done. And I know exactly how teamwork can help everybody in the market. Everybody's been shouting louder and louder because they can't be heard over Dale's loud music. But Dale's only been playing his music loud because he can't use his market cries to let everybody know about his bargains because of his sore throat. But we all know what's good for that problem, don't we? Team, it's a race against time. I've got to do it, I've got to do it. I've got to beat the clock before the chime I've got to sort it, I've got to sort it I've got to do the job on time I like a busy bee, I'm gonna beat that bong I'm gonna finish this job before I finish this song Do we think he's gonna do it? Do the job that needs to be done? Will he know how to fix it? Will he finish what he has begun? Yes, sure we are friends, he will get there in the end Because he knows what he should do, I'm working for I'm gonna do it I'm gonna beat the clock before the chime I'm gonna sort it He's gonna start it I'm gonna do the job on time Like a busy bee, I'm gonna beat that bong I'm gonna finish this job before I finish this song Mmm, my throat's feeling better already, Rudy. Thanks. Don't thank me! Thank the team! Adrian provided the honey Jim, the lemon squeezer, and Susie, the mug and hot water. All I did was squeeze a couple of oranges and lemons, and there you have it, one sore throat cure. Now my voice is better, I can finally start using my market cries again. Brilliant! And I can turn this music down for good. Get your music CDs over here. Best deals in town, guaranteed. Come on, folks, get your lovely juicy, juicy oranges here. I wonder if Granny Murray and the children enjoyed their oranges after the game today. Oh, who would like some orange? Oh, I would love some orange. Oh, help yourselves, mm. my darlings. Would you like a wee piece, Molly? Mmm, they're lovely oranges, Louie. Yep, Rudy only sells the best fruit and veg. <laughs> <laughs> Rudy, come away in. 
Lick is here! Hey. Oh, Hello, Jack. Oh. Come here. Oh, it sounds like someone's had a great time yeah, with Granny Murray. Oh, no, we certainly have, haven't we? Oh, that's right. You say thank you. Oh, thank you, Granny Murray. Great boy. Oh, and thanks from me too, Granny Murray. I remembered what you said. There's nothing like teamwork to get things done, and it saved the day. Oh, well, well. Come on, you two. Come, come on, on mate. to be on the ball. And I suppose you want me to tell you all about my time too. Well, there was waving, greeting, hello, meeting, bye bye, closing, wagging, dozing, eating, sleeping, fetching, sketching, painting, stretching, gluing, chewing, sticking up and wiping round, washing up and slushing down. Then there was hugging, squishing, walking, pushing, dancing, dusting, shooting, choosing, talking, cooking. about today? Well, Claude was dressed up as a football referee today because we were going to play a game of football. I had arranged to meet Louie and Chuck in the park to play football with the children and we all had great fun. I was referee and blew my whistle a lot. Jack was brilliant kicking the ball. Chuck was in the goal. Louie was all over the place. It was team play all the way. Rudy gave us some oranges to nibble on after the game. They were delicious. It sounds like they were much appreciated by Dale at the market today too, to help cure his sore throat. Because in the market, it was team play all the way to... Do you know the best thing about being a referee? Yes, blowing your whistle. <laughs> Did you have fun today? Me too. Bye-bye, honey pie. I love to skip the river sea tingle, river sea tingle, bye. I love to skip the river sea tingle, river sea tingle, that's for me. Come on and get on down to the city, the city. where the fairy boat sails the blue. Time to call on Granny Mo.